Uh, Hollywood pedophile rings. Something we <laughs> oh my haven't God. really discussed on the show <laughs> yet. But hot item. Everyone's talking about who is fucking which boy. Yes. Yeah. What boy is getting turned out? Everybody wants to know. What's you think Drake and Josh got fucked? Yeah, I'm sure. Damn, one both of them has Drake's. a good career. Don't both Drakes? Oh, yeah, you think Drake, Drake was on Degrassi? Drake's oh well. fuck! Yeah. What is, who's Josh? Um, no, it's a Nickelodeon called Drake and Josh. Yeah, no, I know. I'm yeah. Drake Bell's doing uh, well. He yeah, just yeah, like yeah. Got Josh, well. Josh Peck. Josh, Josh Peck, Peck definitely got fucked. Oh, he got fucked sure. by by a really funny yeah. by the funny monster. Now yeah, he's hilarious. Yeah, you're not on mic, so there's no reason yeah, there's no reason to contribute to the conversation. <laughs> yeah. Brandon's in the Brandon's in the room. Uh, the we room. already we already covered all that shit. So yeah, so we're talk we we uh this one's gonna be uh like a more personal. We brought in our friend Evan to right. interview him about have how he's fucked. mostly fucked kids. Yeah. Well, Technically, must. that's true. Te- <laughs> Technically, Evan is mostly fucked is kids. True. The only the only person I ha- I have fucked that isn't wasn't a kid when I fucked him is my wife. Yeah, because Evan got married yeah. young as shit. Oh yeah! So all the I women he child. fucked were ch- children. I was wow. a child as well. He was yeah. always. What, what was the lowest age? Seven, fifteen. Okay, that's fine. I was fourteen. Ooh, oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah, hell yeah, boy! Getting that, oh, getting that ninth grade pussy in eighth grade. I was grade. cool as shit. Um, hell yeah! What was that then? like? Busting your first nut. <laughs> It was nervous and quick, and yeah. <laughs> um, it was New Year's Eve, and Tom Green was like commenting. Tom Green was on the TV doing New Year's. Oh, so you were Whoa. looking at Tom, you were listening to Tom Green's voice the first time you fucked? Nah, I couldn't hear his voice because Marilyn Manson was on. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> so it looked like Tom Green was singing Marilyn Manson. Hell yeah, dude! Wow, yeah, that fucking rocks. The beautiful people. It was pretty sick. That was the song. I actually don't remember the song, but I know it was Marilyn Manson. Nice, was Adam. Playing. When did you bust your first nut? In a uh, woman? when I was like seventeen, like right before I turned eighteen. Nice. And it was we've bad. already we went. We did yeah, we've all already. talked about. All right. This. Well, just True. asking. Well, again. well trod. So there's, I mean, well really, there's nothing. Know, there's nothing know. to talk about other than sexual Sex assault. Rings and stuff? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because that's kind of the that's the news now. <laughs> right. You know, it's funny. Literally, it's like that's all news. There it's is. it's like you know. I see a lot of female comics being like, now it's now it's our time. Now that we're getting rid of the we're draining the swamp, now it's our turn. But it's like, well, not if you write topical jokes, because yep. those are off limits for you. You can't do rape jokes. That's true. <laughs> it's After all, all that, rape. yeah, yeah. Good luck finding something in the news to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> do you think when women are in power, they will rape? Um, Is that part of it? Yes. Yeah, I mean, look at Hillary Clinton. She does. Yep. She kills children and yep. You know, fucks them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pizza shops and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. Evan gets it again. We already yeah. covered all that. Yeah. So. I'm sure you had. I just yeah. I yeah. was letting you know that I know. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I guess. What have you not we covered? Could, Is there a new one in this no, past week? No, there that, really isn't. I yeah. mean, like, we kind of went into all of them on this week's <laughs> okay. prior this premium bonus episode. Oh, yeah. gotcha, Why don't we do gotcha. some fun voices? No, I think that's a. <laughs> we should find something to discuss rather no. than bail in the first two no, seconds let's do into. Fun voices. Let's fun do voices, a fun man. voice. What Evan does good voices, dude. Buddy, all right. You know. I mean, all right, let's find something to discuss, and then we'll do fun voices. We'll okay. The funny. Vo- we'll earn the funny voices. Okay. All right. We'll be a treat to ourselves. Um. All right. Well, I guess Adam pointed out New York Times reviewed Louis C.K.'s movie, and it's not coming out, so there's really no reason to. Review Louis C.K.'s movie. No, they they reviewed it to say that the jokes felt terrible in light of the allegations. Mm. Oh damn! Yeah, mm-hmm. that was kind of a like Louis like trying to do a movie about a guy who fucks up much younger women or whatever. I think it's about a dad whose daughter fucks Daughters. a guy that's a lot older. Yeah. Right, right, right. So it's sort of about the dad that's sort of Malcolm the main victim. Plays I think. The <laughs> yeah, yeah, the man is the problem. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, true. No, yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> Louis is the victim. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. Um, I don't know. I think it's probably interesting and probably pretty good. Is it ever coming out? Can we watch it? Uh, maybe, but probably not. It'd be funny if you went back and look at Hitler's paintings and it's just like him... Fucking some Jewish person's face, you know, and putting a <laughs> knife through their eye socket. <laughs> and they're like, the painting's good, but as this isn't really art school. <laughs> <laughs> Technically, you're you're very skilled, Mister Hitler. <laughs> but <Yeah. laughs> have you ever looked at them? No, of course not. 
I'm not a self-hating Jew that has weird sexual fantasies <laughs> about Nazis, right? I don't have... Look at Hitler's paintings Wait, all just day to long. Be, you were never interested in what his paintings look like. Not in the way you were. <laughs> to jack off to? To jack off yeah. to them. No, they're like, I don't know, they're kind of nice landscapes. Pretty really? like average yeah. paintings. Yeah. yeah. Like a Bob Ross. Well, it's, like it's an empty, like Bob yeah. Ross. It's an empty <laughs> field, but the implication is that there used to be a town there filled with Jews. <laughs> yeah. And so they killed every man, yeah. shipped yeah. off the women, and then burned the city to the ground and paved over it with, with, nice with trees, poppies. Planted trees. Right. Yeah, nice. Hell yeah, dude. Bob Ross was in the military. He was like a like a Special veteran. forces. He was like Vietnam? A, yeah, he was like a hardcore dude, and then he got into painting. Dude, all those season. soft TV voices were like snipers and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Like uh, Mr. Rogers. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Was like, he was like, yeah, Mr. Mr. Rogers. He was, was like an American someone? sniper. He was, Ky what's his name? Something Kyle. Chris, Chris Kyle. Kyle. He, he was Chris Kyle. Yeah, yeah Mr. Rogers. Rogers invented napalm, actually, and he was the first one. He used to put it, he used to make Vietnamese children swallow it. He was and then he Nam? watched them burn from the inside. No, nah, Mr. Rogers wasn't in Nam. Nah, Korea. Yeah. Yeah. The Korea. original Nam. Yep. Mm -hmm. The same country. <laughs> <laughs> Nam won. <laughs> how the fuck did Kim Jong just end up with, how did his dad or granddad or whatever end up with half of Korea? Shouldn't we have fucked them up? What because they wouldn't let MacArthur go north. Mm. I, I learned that from the Rodney Thirty eighth parallel. I learned that from Roger Rodney Dangerfield's Back to School. Oh Do you yeah, the scene with Kinnison. <laughs> ah, 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 I'm a teacher. <laughs> That's where most of my most of my tidbits come from. Is Back to School. I love getting my dick sucked. <laughs> you like that? That's Sam Kinnison. We got to the silly good. voices, yeah. man. <laughs> That's good. Somebody eat my ass. <laughs> That's my character, Sam Kinison. <laughs> yeah, who likes to get his ass eaten. <laughs> That's also just Stav's set. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, really nobody has said. sex with me, <laughs> <laughs> but I'm cute. <laughs> Thank you. But the breakfast. <laughs> That's it. These are great jokes. Well, Thank yeah. you for <laughs> quoting them. <laughs> <laughs> Come see me, guys. I'll be in uh, Cleveland at Hilarities. Uh, December 3rd I'll be Check out his Sunday. album But the breakfast On <laughs> iTunes Avocados <laughs> if you're nasty That wouldn't be That wouldn't uh -huh. be uh, The name of the It's he's album. selling t-shirts guys But the breakfast <laughs> I will not be <laughs> selling But like the sell. breakfast t-shirts yeah. <laughs> Come see Nick Do his Harambe joke For 12 months in a row You're doing I watched you do a joke Last night about I'm going through a breakup And I know that was Six what, Five years ago <laughs> Yeah but uh, <laughs> yeah, It was There's always you know, I just yeah, stopped doing joke. comedy Because the news joke. sucks now and there's nothing else to talk about. Yeah, you can just I'm do not still doing a Harambe bit because I'm not doing bits anymore. <laughs> yeah, now I'm well. a professional broadcaster. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, that was Sam Kinison asking to get his ass eaten, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know what? I'm going to stop doing the heavy lifting then, guys, if that's it. I had Sam Kinison. You know, you guys do a good character. Adam? Oh God! We mm -hmm. you're back here. Okay. Yeah, oh, How yeah, about, we're back here. One. How about uh, it, you know, it said, <laughs> please, Mister Louis C.K. <laughs> <laughs> Do not shout. Now, see, finally. <laughs> Do not hack off in front of me, please. <laughs> <laughs> That's the small day. It's all the uh, small day labor that would have been the world's most famous comedian. <laughs> 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 Louis C.K. not jacked off in front of him. Yeah, man. All the shows that Day Laborer would have done are booked yeah. by Dave Becky. So <laughs> Dave Becky yeah. completely yeah. could his career. Yeah. Right. Miguel, if you want to have a career, <laughs> you will shut the fuck up. <laughs> I just, where to put the dragon one? I just want to play my ukulele <laughs> <laughs> and talk about how I eat pizza in bed. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to be adorable and do adorable comedy where I don't really observe anything or have a punchline. I just <laughs> talk about how hard it is to be an adult because I don't know which part of the check is the routing number or the account number? <laughs> is that like uh, what like adulthood is? Yeah. <laughs> That's his bit. It's good. That's a dorky old man. day late. He got bro. discovered in the parking lot at Home Depot. Mm -hmm. And then by some coked up producer that's yeah. like if you suck my dick, <laughs> you can be in the parent trap. Yeah. <laughs> He's just the waiter in the yeah, parent yeah, trap. Yeah. That's how they cast everyone in movies. Yeah. <laughs> it's like every extra sucked some guy's dick right. to just be standing in the well, back. If you look at the guy washing the dishes, he's like staring off into the distance. <laughs> <laughs> the crack epidemic. The crack epidemic and like... 
you know, the 1980s and, like, what that did to inner cities and, like, the amount of violence and gang violence and shit. It's not like rich people didn't do cocaine, but the problems it created in those communities is, like, you know, making them rape everyone they work with. Yep. You know, yeah. Yep. And, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, the, well, again, the child pedophilia rings in It forced in them Hollywood. to. In many ways, uh, the fact that the government uh, diluted cocaine through crack when they gave it to inner city communities was... Yeah, uh, like was charity. Yeah, you know, because yeah. full blown cocaine in those neighborhoods. Woof. Because Reagan saw it. what Tell happened in much. real yes, Hollywood. Exactly. So he exactly. wanted to protect. They the tested in Hollywood. They started fucking all the kids. And then when Reagan invented crack cocaine, he's like, uh, yes, he's like, we he can't like, let them go. I that care about hard. black people too much. I know <laughs> it's true. Let's step on this a little bit. We can't give them the puree, uh, baking soda. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Give them the baking. Get the acetone, man. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that's cool. Have you ever done crack, Evan? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah, dude. Yeah. Was that cool? It was pretty tight. Man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was really tight, dude. That's like one thing I'll it's say about you, crack. It was actually. Yeah. Well, it was actually pretty cool. Really good. <laughs> it's weird that you like can't just be a guy that smokes crack. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> just chilling out with a nice little rock in yeah. your day. You can't like yeah. brag about crack either. Like, I'm people doing brag it right now, me. man. I'm doing it right what now. Set the scene for us. Um, everything's going great in your life. <laughs> everything's going real bad, yeah, and yeah, yeah. Uh, everybody's dead that I've ever loved. <laughs> <laughs> and my buddy was like, "Do you want to feel this stronger?" And I was like, "Yeah." And so he cooked up some coke and a spoon. Oh, he cooked it up. Yeah, I free based coke, which is oh, like free based thing. Right? Oh no, that's yeah. different. It's different. That's completely different. Okay. Well, then yeah. I did not. There's smoke like crack. a depravity to smoking crack that yeah, like, doesn't yeah. exist with free basing cocaine. Yeah, I mean, but millionaires free base cocaine. It felt time. way different than snorting it, though, man. Free basing. What cocaine. did it feel like? I mean, just like uh, more worrisome, <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, <laughs> and, yeah, uh, yeah. and scary. <laughs> so how does but it work? You good. Just, you cook it and then you f- like snort you it. Just, you just you, yeah. you, you draw you, in the smoke the with the straw. fumes. Oh. Yeah, yeah. You heat it up and then you suck yeah. the fumes. Oh shit! Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, like that's lace, homemade crack. lace blunts with it and stuff. But that's not this. That's mm. a weird high, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. crack yeah. a blunt with coke. Yeah, crack. You like mix the you coke. You put something more with, in it. You're right. Baking yeah. soda and then you you like cook that on the stove and water and then the shit that rises to the top is like a yellow fucking sediment or something. And you take that and then dry it out. And then that's the bubbly the stuff? Yeah, something it, like right, that. Maybe I smoked crack. I don't know. No, because like, you have to make crack on like a stove top. Okay. This I mean, there's different, it, different so ways I, to do it. I yeah. think that, I, I was... I, I probably mean, I've never crack. Cocaine. There's a lot yeah. of songs you could listen to where they tell you how to do it. Yeah. yeah. True, man. Water True. whip it. Mm-hmm. Stirring a pot with the Uzi. <laughs> that's how you do it, right? Um, yeah, that's the only yeah. way I've ever made crack. Yeah, I snorted meth. Nice. I never smoked meth. I snorted meth. And I did a bunch of, like, heroin and meth within the uh, ecstasy I was doing. You know, nice. it was all, like, very cut with Super either heroin cut, or yeah. meth. And I like the meth more because, like, oh, you're, you're up, you know? Like, yeah, with the, yeah, yeah. You want to get your money's worth out of the yeah, ecstasy. Yeah, man. Yeah, you fuck and stuff. And yes. I didn't fuck ever. But, you didn't uh, fuck on ecstasy? Uh, my girlfriend one time, yeah, but not. not I didn't but like yeah, go out, yeah. and, you know, get some really strange. lay it down. Yeah. Um, um, how how'd your cock work on the on those drugs? Like not at all. And then once it did, it worked forever. You know? <laughs> it was one of those things. So it took forever. And like then an old lawnmower that won't. You got the record <laughs> yeah. going a bunch of times. Yeah, yeah. once it's and going, you know, got a like, like, whole neighborhood. Yeah, yeah. yeah. fuck yeah. everyone in your neighborhood. Yeah, man. Break into their homes, fuck that's them fine. while they're sleeping. Yeah, yeah. we wanted and to have fine. Ian on the show because he had a funny experience with. We can just tell Ian's story. Yeah, let's tell that Absolutely. story. That Ian was just in LA and had an unfortunate experience with a oh, trans heard. prostitute. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I think he got. Uh, yeah, he like. <laughs> <laughs> he gets like the you know when you get, get like to do an airport and then there's all the rental car places and it's like Alamo Enterprise you know budget yes. and whatever and then there's one of them that's like Lorenzo's cars <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. he it's like a cardboard <laughs> sign yeah right yeah. Ian gets like that version of prostitute mm-hmm. <laughs> and it, it also exists just in the near room. the airport you yeah, know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah 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 he's fucking you know Motel Six in Inglewood with. <laughs> yeah. you know, <laughs> um, 
<laughs> yeah, no, he asked to eat her ass, and she <laughs> said no. <laughs> she was like, <laughs> he said, do you mind if I eat your ass? <laughs> <laughs> Madam, would you yeah. mind do if you I mind? <laughs> and she said on no. Your asshole. <laughs> yeah. He got, he yeah. got out alpha <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> What a hilarious person he is. <laughs> he is I was really asking him, I was like, how did you like know that that was what you were into yeah you know yeah because i can't imagine even if i thought maybe that might be my thing and yeah. it ends up not being you right then you're <laughs> like oh, <laughs> it's fuck. a rough night yeah, right. yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. well you he's know? crazy like the kind of people he hooks yeah, w- up with he will well he, he will got- shine a flashlight in their asshole before <laughs> yeah, he like <laughs> Like he literally, he told me he's like, yeah, just like flash a light in their asshole <laughs> just to, see, to it see if clear? it's safe for me to dive in there, uh, and then he just dives in. Well, <laughs> yeah. he goes, he's got a little fucking miner's helmet on. <laughs> yeah. he he's got a little sickle and stuff. He's like <laughs> taking off a chunk and putting it under a microscope. He's like, me and my friend, we used to play with each other's dicks, and then one time I showed him a picture I drew of a a lady <laughs> that okay? had a We're penis. So, yeah, whatever. Forget, What's fuck that? Uh, no. Go Go ahead. Yeah, uh, no, this is what he told me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We used to play with each other's dicks, and I drew a picture of a lady, you know, with a penis, and he got mad at me. <laughs> <laughs> His friend got mad at him. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well, he's like, hey, can you go back to sucking me off, please? <laughs> yeah. Enough of these fucking yeah. arts and crafts. <laughs> I haven't come yet, Ian. Wait, so is Ian... A st- uh, did he go off the wagon or he just did no, that, like, no, no, no yeah no. that's what he does he's like you know with me it's either like drugs or sex or whatever you know it's like yeah I mean there's a lot of wagons of life that yeah. he's yeah, not yeah, on yeah, 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 yeah. he, he lives on the sober wagon. trail of depravity <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah 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 he's not drinking right yeah, now but right. boy is he eating tranny for, ass for dysentery yeah, and, yeah. yeah. That's, it's real rough man um, oh yeah well good for you know good for him no slut shaming, no, no. Whatever you're into, Good guys. Dude, trans f- having yes. sex. You can do whatever you want as long as it's not being watched while jacking off. Yeah, <laughs> that's the one thing, <laughs> the one type of behavior that's completely unacceptable, <laughs> even if you ask for permission to do it. <laughs> or jacking off on a, on the phone. Well, to right? be fair, he didn't ask permission in that case. He did not. But, but like. Oh, well, come on. You're going <laughs> to... No, thank you. <laughs> you picked, you picked what the you, one example picked, in that yeah. story really? where it's like, this is that part is indefensible. Uh, you don't yeah. just play with your dick when you're at home and then sometimes... Yeah, don't don't try a, and there's a big difference it. between... Yeah. I do it all the time. In that case, I've raped every customer service member. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think my hand's in my pants on oh, any 45-minute phone call? That's how call. we what get back at... a day of that, a lot of phone calls? But how, here's the other thing. Don't they don't know that I'm, like, touching... I'm not, like, jacking off and telling like. Keeping them on the phone longer, yeah, yeah, and yeah. like breathing heavily, and like that's what I'm gonna do. Start I mean, doing it's creepy. To fucking it's Verizon, undeniably dude. creepy. Yeah, to Verizon to get back at customer service reps, Hell I'm gonna yeah. start beating off. Yeah, <laughs> what do you mean like, to get back those, those at customer service guys reps? Are gonna really <laughs> what have they done them to for you? Poor You're gonna show yeah. them. Yeah. They, they narrowly escaped having their eyes boiled out of their skulls so they could be better at singing. Some morbidly obese man is gonna stroke regular obese. Thank you. Yeah. Not morbid, I just mean, very. No, it's morbid, dude. That's no, it's like, not morbid. It's a morbid's medical, like the. Yeah, I'm like being the nice by using really doctors. Like, it's really like very. Uh, no, no, brutal medical term. Just morbid. obese. Thank you. Yeah. Like you know, just you know, obese. You know what my favorite one is? <laughs> is uh, they don't use it anymore, but profoundly retarded. <laughs> <laughs> Which just sounds like an insult. I, don't yeah, know. Yeah. I can't imagine a context when that was ever like a nice term to use for somebody. Congratulations. Yeah. Your son is not just retarded. He's yeah. profoundly, profoundly retarded. retarded son. <laughs> they give you, you a little there. medal. <laughs> <laughs> He's the winner of the retarded Olympics at uh, his school. Yeah, we're going to make a fucked up statement. Statue of him. <laughs> big smooth head. Popsicle stick. His almond shaped eyes. <laughs> <and the> Chinese <laughs> eyelids. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway. You can't be mean to him anymore. Not even if you're a doctor. Mm. Mm-hmm. No, you should, can. You just how have to much go to it, school. How much would it have sucked to be like, you know, 
it's like maybe 1987, you're just finishing up middle school school, and you're like, I did all this work so I could make fun of retarded people. <laughs> and they change and it. And they change it. Wow. The, they change it. Pull so the, the rug doctor's right out job from under you. isn't to come up with new insults for retarded people. Because for 100 years, they got away with it. Like, mongoloids. We're going to call them idiots. We're going to call them mongoloids. Yep. We're going to call them, you know, freaks. Yep. Yeah. And geeks. Yep. You know? Mm-hmm. Chowderheads. Then, right. And then now they finally settled on the one true thing that'll never be ruined. Ruined by association, mm-hmm. intellectually disabled. Yep. I feel like it was nice when they called them like the village idiot. Like they're part of the community. Mm-hmm. You know. Right. Yep. Inclusive. Now yeah. we just may, now we just, they just live out on the street and we don't like. We well, try not to look at them. They don't necessarily out. live on the street. That'd be fun if yeah. you. I mean, I think community. that's sort of what we do with mentally ill people in this country. Is not we men- we're talking about the, the the disabled. Yeah, we're talking disabled. about right. mentally retarded, um, handicapped. Yes, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. not retarded that's a difference. Versus, yeah, versus yeah, yeah, crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Whoa, okay. whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't buddy. use that word ableist, anymore, man. Yeah, <laughs> That's an sorry. ableist term. Yeah. That's my favorite shit online. It's saying crazy. I'm an insane person that's incapable of rational thought. Here's how society should work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here's how people should interact with each other. <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. <clears throat> so, we're all exhausted, right? From. We did some. This rapes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, thing. yeah. What'd you I guys do? No, it's just we all <laughs> rant <laint> each other. <laughs> we, yeah, we. No. It's just and a never, fucking nauseating, you know, news cycle. Yeah, sex, yeah. sex trauma is like, you know, it's been three weeks of everywhere you look. It's just sex trauma. It's stuff. brutal, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's like you know what it feels like is, I I remember this like distinctively sick feeling that I would get when I was exposed to like celebrity gossip or entertainment news because I don't care. I don't give a shit. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. And like when. You know, Access Hollywood or whatever would be on or something. It just like bothered me. Yeah, you know? it's loud. Of I don't care. Yeah. I don't Mario know. Lopez. I literally smiling don't know much. who the Kardashians are. I don't fucking know. Yeah, you I do. Know. No, I don't. I know who Kim Kardashian is because she's like, what the head you know of that the dad was human centipede. I know. Yeah. It's, yeah. Yeah. He's the lawyer for OJ. But again, right. this is like it's a whole world that always just sort of bothered. Like, yeah. I don't care for it. Right. You know? Right. Right. And now it feels like. I mean, because the the sex assault thing kind of just exists in that realm. Yeah, it's celebrity news. It is. It's Mm -hmm. celebrity gossip. And it's not like, whatever. I mean, problems about, you know, systemic sexism aside, it's like this, it, it is still just fucking gossip about, you know, who did what to who in the entertainment world. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. and we'll feel like people will feel like they did, they accomplished something by certain people's career is being destroyed but n- the systems are going to stay exactly the same you think it'll stay think? exactly the same i think i think a lot yes i think that it'll find so you think the next so there's gonna be like a they're gonna purge this group of rapers yeah that's how it all and then the works. next group of jewish rapers will just be yeah exactly mm-hmm. there's a whole new class of us it's like the x-men uh next x-men first class, <laughs> first class and then also who class. was a raper yeah. 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 What, what, what's up with pedophile. brian singer how has he not he's been, been thrown getting under internet yet? like i know scrubbed We've been, yeah. we've been talking about it. Okay. That's you sort see, of what's been making Nick lose his mind. Did you see uh-huh. that Gary Goddard was like accused publicly yeah. by yeah. Goose from Top Gun? And like Goddard was part of that <laughs> yeah. lawsuit against Singer like three years ago. Uh-huh. Have you and, seen uh, An Open Secret? Of course. We talked about yeah, it on the yeah. show. Yeah. I saw it too. Yeah. God, I missed the juice, man. Yeah, it's all I right, I missed dude. the meat and potatoes. Yeah. It's all right. It's uh, it's crazy, man. Yeah, it's fucked up, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's also in take, other. It's it, fucked up. Yeah, it's also like kind of everywhere. You know, I mean, it's in politics and stuff like that. Yep. But it's just like the Hollywood portions being talked what? about right now. Like, do you think the politicians will start are also raping children? Well, I know that they are. The thing well, is, I mean, it's like like more. Pizza Gate. Pizza Gate was probably the best thing to happen to them because now it gets to be like an insane mm-hmm. old right conspiracy rather than yeah. like, you know. A thing that's actually happening. <laughs> You're like, oh, yeah, it's a fucking pizza shop. Well, it's like a, they, but really, it's a sandwich shop in real, <laughs> life, in real yeah. life. Well, no, really, it's a private island that they would yeah, fly to. Yeah, yeah. That, you know, uh, the guy that ran charter services to Child Rape Island did, what, 12 months? Yeah. yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, it, and, today, and it was for not registering the plane. 
Yeah. It was not registering with Dude, the Dude, that Jeepers FAA. Creepers director, man. Yeah. yeah. He's <laughs> making Jeepers Creepers 3 right now. All, he uh, used... Hold on. Every movie he made happened after the conviction. I know. And one of them was a Disney movie. Like, yeah. right after the conviction. Oh, which was yeah. a Disney movie. <laughs> Victor it, uh, Silva. Uh, Powder. Powder yeah, was Powder. Disney. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, Victor Silva. He, like, right, right. We talked about yeah. it. Raped a child. <laughs> yeah. Not only did he rape a child. He taped it. It was on, it was on the set of a killer clown movie. And Whoa. so he raped him in a horror set. Whoa. Yeah. Like in like a, a haunted circus that's set. Damn, oh, bro. He raped a kid. That's, yeah. That Fuck. kid is fucked Just to up, add to the probably. horror, man. Yeah. What an yeah. all. How I got this hard. <laughs> 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 and then today, in response to the Roy Moore thing, uh, all these girls are getting behind this hashtag, me at 14. Meet 14. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> which is basically. Oh, oh no! <laughs> which is, uh, is it just like, some guy with like a fourteen-inch dick posting his dick? <laughs> on that mad. He's like, "What? I, don't, I thought it was for me. <laughs> I'm not a rapist. I, I was, I've been using this big penis hashtag for years. <laughs> you stole it. <laughs> Meet fourteen. <laughs> Get that nice fat yeah. hog out there. Yeah, yeah. Just the oiled-up fucking yeah. 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 Nice man with the cock. world's largest penis. <laughs> It's just hot like, water yeah. again today. <laughs> <laughs> There's a butcher on 14th like Street Falcon? just like posting his butcher shop. <laughs> yeah, Jonah Falcon. Jonah Falcon. But that's the, that's the funniest kind of person to be is when your dick is so Medically big you have big. to be gay. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's yeah. that's the reason He's I'm like, gay. well, it doesn't... <laughs> <laughs> Why? So you can suck the world's biggest penis? Yes, yeah. I can suck up the world's biggest cock. <laughs> I just want to be the best at everything. I want to be the very best. <laughs> it's sucking big fat cocks. Suck. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta suck them all. Um, yeah, but then, like, yeah, the response is that girls are just putting up, like, the sexiest pictures of them at 14. Mm-hmm. So says like, Adam. I mean, not the fuck? This is not, not a, 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 an objective s- statement yeah, about yeah, the yeah, hashtag. Yeah. This is Adam's opinion. Yeah. 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 He's like, but uh, I, I don't get it because every picture I see makes me hard. Yeah. So I don't <laughs> think that it's really getting, it's really no. accomplishing what they wanted to. Mm-hmm. No, Because now doing, I've started talking to 14-year-old right, girls right, right, and right, right. trying to lure them into my not one bedroom apartment in Brooklyn. <laughs> and I'm like, hey, do you guys need a tutor? It's I a actually went to law I almost went to law school. <laughs> I have a dog too. Okay. So uh, <laughs> Yeah, and she gets angry if girls don't do what I tell them to. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> so Isn't that right? Uh, you put the little mask on ISIS. <laughs> You're gonna make the dog mad again. <laughs> like, That's your threat to him. So yeah. you, him. <laughs> you wanna make this dog mad? <laughs> It's <laughs> the least threatening bark. I'll do whatever you say, Mr. Friedland. <laughs> All right. That's not what I was trying to say, <laughs> but No, so, yeah. they're like sexualizing themselves at 14 for basically I mean, but sharing I, this trauma. How are they sexualizing themselves though? Because they're putting up like pictures of themselves as tr- children. Yeah, but they're not saying Isn't the look point, how sexy I the, was. The point is the kids. They're putting pictures hot. of yeah. themselves up as children, and you're getting hard to it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you're sexualizing. Yeah, that's not true. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know. We might have to fire everyone associated with the show because of Adam's shit. Theater. Yeah, you're gonna have to. We're all gonna lose our jobs. Yeah. Nah. The only um, thing, the only fair thing to do when somebody gets caught. Uh, with sexual misconduct is destroy the lives of hundreds of people around them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know? Working on Alan Alda needs to be taken down. <laughs> yeah. You know I mean? Anyone who's ever been in a movie with them should be fired. Anyone, yeah. you know, so with mm-hmm. the same hair color. Oh, yeah. yeah. Gingers, man. They yeah. If, Steve, yeah. if Steve Harvey ever gets exposed, probably like 10,000 people will lose Shit, he job. did do kids. Didn't he do that Kids Say the Darnest Thing reboot? Yeah. He yeah, probably yeah. fucked those kids. Um, <laughs> allegedly, allegedly. Yeah. Well, the, the darndest thing is always. <laughs> 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 um, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's a Bill Cosby with a kid on his lap. What do you is say something <laughs> fucked up, kid? And then the kid's like, "You raped me." Like, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Ooh, the the thing. <laughs> That's what we tune in for, folks. <laughs> <laughs> That is, that is darn it. Cosby. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, uh, fuck. Now, what the hell? <laughs> uh, yeah, but, you know, I was thinking, you know how, like, the army had to cover up in Afghanistan, how, like, all those people were fucking boys, like the tribal yeah, yeah, leaders yeah, 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 yeah. or whatever. And the it's Northern like, Alliance? Yeah, it, this just has to be a thing everywhere. You think everyone fucks kids? Everywhere yeah, with power. I mean, it's not like, does it, like, why, why would they be doing that, you know? That's not really... Is that specific to their culture or, like, what... You mean in Afghanistan? Yeah. Like, what... I don't know. Someone... And this is completely non-sourced or educated at all, but I don't know. Someone's saying because they treat women bad, you can only fuck boys or something? Yeah, well, they. I guess they certainly well, they treat women, women right too. in Hollywood. <laughs> yeah. That's what yeah. I was about to say, like... It's well, you didn't same. say it. I said it first. Right. So, <laughs> Adam's Adam Bitch. was that kid in elementary school that after someone would answer correctly goes, oh, "I was gonna say that." <laughs> <laughs> or like when when they when they announce the answers to the homework, the like, yes. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, yes was a good move. Was Adam was a kid. yes. I, you know what? I was never yes. That kid. And then he would get <laughs> reprimanded for saying yes. And then he would just do the arm thing. <laughs> in the silence. No, I, I loved saying I yes. Was, honestly. Cool. No, you were a nerd. I was a nerd, too. Um, we're going to take a quick break, and we'll be right back with the conclusion to how gay Adam was as a child. <laughs> <laughs> well, folks, are you tired of being naked? Good news. Uh, we got some underwear for you to recommend. MacWeldon.com. Uh, MacWeldon, it's a newer underwear company, I think. I actually don't know. I don't know how long they've been around. Um, but uh, they're a great company. Uh, that believes in uh, smart design, premium fabrics, and simple shopping. You go online, it'll be the easiest online shopping experience you've ever had. You know, like uh, different than your normal purchases where you have to get Bitcoin in the Tor browser and, uh, you know, keep a bunch of secrets, pay people off. You don't have to do that with Mack Weldon. It's, it's very easy. You go on there. They got comfortable underwear, uh, socks, shirts, undershirts, hoodies, and sweatpants. Um, and they even have a line of silver underwear and shirts that are naturally antimicrobial, which means they eliminate odor, folks, and they want you to be comfortable. So if you don't like your first pair of underwear, you can return it, and they'll refund you, no questions asked. Uh, not only does Mack Weldon underwear, sock shirts uh, look good, they perform well, too, you know, so they're not just for working out or going out on the town. You can wear them at home or on vacation or whatever. I don't... You know, I don't normally have special vacation underwear, but if you're the kind of person that does that, these are uh, multifunction. They work uh, uh, cross-platform. So go to MacWeldon.com and get 20% off using the promo code COMETOWN. That's C-U-M-T-O-W-N. Uh, and if you're one of the many ladies that listens to the show, um, you know, perfect uh, Hanukkah gift for your boyfriend that forces you to listen to our podcast. So... Go to MacWeldon.com. Use promo code COMETOWN to get 20% off. Thanks, guys. What did you do to him? Tell 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 the adoring fans of the show. I kissed Brandon's cock. Yeah. I kissed speak, the tip Brandon, of his cock. Brandon's here, and he doesn't have a mic because he's doesn't have the courage to speak out about, <laughs> <laughs> about all of the men that he's have been diddled so many times yeah. and he's Adam's so scared. Been, <laughs> <laughs> sorry his hands are shaking so much yeah. right now Brandon's been he was crying the first raped. half yeah. <laughs> every time every time we brought up uh, boys getting fucked in Hollywood <laughs> yeah we did all fuck his mouth did yeah. you use the term sexually raped <laughs> yeah he was sexually raped <laughs> well there's lots of kinds of rape there's sexual rape there's career rape there's rape of disagreement you know? <laughs> oh, <that's true>. there's <laughs> rape by being booked on a show that someone else isn't you know? that's yeah. a form of there's rape. micro rapes yeah right. of course yeah you get hugged micro weird that's when rapes, adam yeah. rapes you with his little ass dick yeah that's when a white person accidentally has curly hair yeah. <laughs> if you go to the beach and you don't get your hair straightened afterwards if yeah. you're if you're a cracker Mm. Then I'm sorry, <laughs> folks. Yeah. Why people? Why people? <clears throat> I thought that was I for a long time. I was like, I thought that was like a, an anagram. <laughs> oh really? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was like, why you put what? What the fuck does this mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I couldn't. What do you mean? What do you? What, why pe the, the online people refer to white people as W Y P O P I P O. I what? never saw that, man. W yeah. You guys spend more time. Well, that's because that content isn't for you. <laughs> yeah. It's not for your eyes. <laughs> yeah, man. I feel like you guys are too in the internet, dude. 
I feel I'm like. I'm actually not anymore. No, I'm like that's not good. on anything. Yeah. You know, I'm more of a video games. You spent years though. You did you did plenty of tours yeah, in Iraq. Your time, you did. Man. Yeah. Yeah. You were really yeah. online for In a lot of ways, you know, I am like a veteran. Yeah, you're a veteran of the internet. Dude. I am. <laughs> yeah. So yesterday was for me. <laughs> it's weird with all the sexual assault talk on Veterans Day, we didn't hear anything about like how huge of a problem yeah, that is yeah, in the yeah, military. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. That is true. Yeah. That's one that's completely completely kept silent. People cared about that for like twenty minutes. Yeah, what and happened? Then it was that like, was ah, like, whatever. Yeah. Then they were like yeah. That's the thing is because like it, with widespread systemic abuse, you can be like, holy shit. And then it's like, well, how do we stop this? And it's like, I guess we're kind of powerless. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you know, I, I'm going to go back to playing Gran Turismo. Yeah. <laughs> and that's I'm going to keep things calling it Gran forever. Turismo yeah. as well. Instead of what? Turismo? Is it not Turismo? It's Turismo. I think it's Turismo. You <laughs> Am I the asshole? Yeah, oh, yeah, Jesus yeah. Christ. Man. Damn, you said it with confidence. I'm from the South, dude. We're stupid. Yeah, Ask you Mateo. Are. Mateo would know. Yeah, it's Grand true. Turismo. Well, I guess yeah, if you're pronouncing it like the Italian. Grand you know? Turismo. <laughs> turismo. Did, uh, did, uh, did Mateo show you that clip of him on that like Mexican talk show? <laughs> yeah, and he was saying something. Or it looks like he's all at Conan and he's on the chair and he's like, you know, <laughs> you know, speaking in fucking Spanish or whatever. Yeah. And then it and cuts then to the host and it's just a clown. <laughs> 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 he's like, hey, grande, grande. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, salute yeah. to fucking Mexican television. They have yeah. the most hilarious shows. Yeah, they so got good. big ladies with and big ass titties. Yeah. yeah, just throwing pies in they're their midget all, face. All I those girls are married to the executives of that network. Oh yeah, yeah. They they ain't got no problems if you know what I'm saying. That's those right. girls understand what the price of doing business <laughs> is. <laughs> Yeah, my yeah, wife watches who, that all the time. That's who needs to take over Hollywood after all this is Maryland Dundalk guys. Ralph. Yeah. <laughs> okay, all right. Oh, we're going to be straight up about this, yo. If you ain't sucking, you ain't getting on screen, baby girl. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we're going to do the same behavior, but it ain't a secret anymore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's what people don't like so, is dishonest. <laughs> I'm honest. Say I'm a fucking liar. I'll beat the fuck out of you. <laughs> okay, no blacks either, though. <laughs> <laughs> they don't show up on a camera. Yo, y'all get Black Panther twice. Uh, every two years, we'll do another Black Panther, and that's it, yo. They let Everything black else is going to be movies. girls with big-ass titties and are white, or every maybe a Latina. Needs all these lights. We're yeah. wasting all these money on lights so the black people show up in movies. <laughs> I'm tired of doing that shit. I want to shoot something in late afternoon without having to fucking, you know, Y'all. drain the entire city grid. Yo, go do the halftime show at a basketball game, yo. They got the lights figured out for y'all already. Okay, movies is for the white. Race, yo. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, put him in charge, baby. Yeah, that's a great guy to run everything. Really. <laughs> I don't think I know this guy. Man. Who's oh, this guy? you got. I got to take you down to Baltimore, dude. Show you all all about these <laughs> well, guys. It's sort of based on like a specific guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, one guy. Yeah. <laughs> there is one guy <laughs> who you can't really mention on the show because he probably will like drive here to try and hundred percent, one hundred percent. No, nobody talks shit about me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. They fucking said I was running Hollywood. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> I work in fucking Batteries Plus. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, I steal the batteries. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck, dude. <clears throat> God, I miss, I miss my hometown. I miss the charm. Speaking of, I will be there Thanksgiving Wednesday. <laughs> I'm a, Baltimore I'm so sidebar. Up. Sidebar. Uh, next uh, Wednesday. Yeah, before Thanksgiving. The Wednesday before Thanksgiving, I'm doing a show, so come out, and maybe I'll do 20 minutes of that character. I'm so hungry, dude. What do you want to eat? I don't know. I need some, something like a chicken salad. Or okay. Something. Mm, okay. Yeah, trying, yeah, trying to get back on track, that, man. I am, dude. I've been yeah. eating literal Halloween candy for three weeks. <laughs> you got any candy corn here? Candy you like corn? candy corn? I love. I'm like the one what? guy that likes it, dude. I'm keeping really? the business alive. Yeah. Holy well, you're shit. not the one guy that likes it. Obviously, know, lots I of didn't people literally like mean it. one. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but yeah, I most literally. motherfuckers don't like it. Yeah. Most motherfuckers I think, don't I like think it. Most people pretend not to like candy corn because candy? of. No. But it's a seasonal candy. It's not like it's around all year long. But it yeah, does it's not suck buggy. Dick. It's like, like it's not good. It's just. It's whatever. I don't mind candy corn. I don't remember it just being tastes like icing. Guys, here's how I feel about candy corn. 
If it's, I kind of feel like it's cocaine, you know. Like if it's. Oh, <laughs> 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 no, I actually do no. agree. I agree with that observation, hundred no, percent. Yeah, that's a good. It's uh, a. <laughs> yeah. Why did Why did Brandon, Brandon get mad? Because it's his. Yeah, yeah. He was stealing, oh. a, he was stealing a joke from me. Ironic. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I actually do feel that way. Yeah, though. it hurts. Like I only like it's not good, but if there's a bowl of it, I'm gonna fucking inhale it. God right. Fucking what? Man. Is that your I'm bit? Sure. You, you, know who had, you know who had the best candy it's corn bit? It's a bit I can do three weeks out of three <laughs> <laughs> The best candy corn... Louis Black had the best candy corn bit. What was it? Oh, yeah. He was about like, how every piece Republican. of candy corn <laughs> has been... Was produced in 1930. <laughs> <laughs> and the same batch is still floating around. That is funny. <laughs> Nobody fucking likes it. <laughs> Remember how did, funny he was for like yeah, a year? Dude. He was funny. And then he pointed with his pinky. correspondence. Yeah. He loved pointing with a his pinky. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> when he got, when he blew up, my dad was like oddly like way into him. My dad was like, oh, wow, this guy's great. You know, dads loved him, man. He had yeah. that angry energy that Well, all then dads like after have. like two months of that, my dad was like, all right, I got to tell you. I used to buy coke off him. <laughs> yeah, he, he told me that. No. Yeah. I was like, that you have to be mistaken. <laughs> yeah, he, he is from DC though, isn't he? No, this was in no, New York. In New York, oh. he was a playwright for a long time. Really? Yeah. Before he got into comedy. Yeah. And he used hey, to sell, he sell coke? Yeah. My man Whoa. was fucking moving. I mean, yay. I don't know yeah. that. I mean, it's like I don't want to just yeah. say say that Lewis Black was a coke dealer based on my dad's assumption that the, <laughs> it was the same guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I, was, I don't think he, like, routinely did it. I think it was one time. Oh, he bought coke once. Yeah. And it was off, Lewis Black. Off him specifically. That's mm, pretty cool. Interesting. Yeah. He's gay, right? My dad? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah it's hereditary. Old, yeah. Boom. Big old queer. Runs in the family. It skips dude. a generation. No, it doesn't. Yes, it no. does. <laughs> no, it does not. So it goes my no. dad, does. then Stav, who's technically my son because I fuck his mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh. First of all, you guys only kiss and she jerks you off. She told me you're lying about fucking her. Uh, what? Yeah, because I destroyed her pussy the first time. <laughs> it's now inside so out. So it's inoperable. Yeah, there's Fuck. there's caution tape all over it, like a badass comedian's <laughs> debut album <laughs> yeah. wrapped around his mouth, yeah. around the mouth, baby. Yeah, it's Dude, I went there to was a, a guy in Baltimore that used to have that as a head. Shouts shot. out, it's shouts out, Tommy Shabazzo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> shouts out to Tommy with the caution tape. Yeah, <laughs> I do. I actually well, do is, fuck yeah. with Tommy. Yeah, Dana, he's Dana's, steampunk. Dana's like first paid show or first book show or whatever. We were both on that. Show, yeah. It was uh, with a Tommy Simbazo show. So at her mom's house, there's like a Tommy Simbazo <laughs> poster that, like, on the fridge. That same poster's on my fridge. That was one of the my mom. My <laughs> mom kept it and fucking put it on the fridge. Yeah, for whatever reason. That my, was my mom did that. I, I I featured for Ryan Stout in San Antonio, and that was like my first like out of town feature yeah. paid gig being put up in a hotel or whatever. And my mom just printed out the website, so it's just like a picture of Ryan <laughs> Stout with like a listing of the show. My name's not even on. Like it, says, it says also appearing Nick Mullen at the bottom. <laughs> That's cute though that she printed it out. Yeah, no, she it's has adorable. she has that and like my GED in a drawer. <laughs> you got GED? Yeah, I do. Whoa, man! You drop. When did you drop out of high school? When I like the beginning of my junior year. Wow. Yeah. Because, I mean, it was, like, clear that I was not going to finish. Yeah. You know? It was pretty clear I wasn't going to, but I somehow just did. I, just I, like, powered through? I bullshitted my senior projects. Like, I bullshitted a lot of stuff, and I made it. Oh, I never but, did any work. Yeah. I mean, like, ever. Okay. <laughs> it was never, yeah. like... I think it was clear when I was in, like, fifth grade that I was, like, not going to go. <laughs> you were just a kid who literally never had his homework. Yeah, I just never did. Because it's, like, yeah. there's no consequence. Yeah. Right. They're just, like, you fail. I'm, like, all right, okay. Right. Yeah. Dude, am I going to be held back a grade? And they're, like, no, nah, you just get to continue. Oh, yeah. yeah. They did that in Maryland. They started doing that. You they just stopped to, holding people just, back? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wow. I would still be in third grade if they... <laughs> Do you know that guy, Dominic Leonetti? What is his name? Mm. Dominic he... Leonetti, yeah. Some Italian guy, you know. Dominic... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's a comedian, man. I'll look up his name. He fucking learned that, like... The special classes didn't have homework. Oh. <laughs> and he pretended to be special. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, yeah. He All right, Dominic Leonelli, dude. Look uh, up look up this guy, man. Yeah. He has a video on YouTube where he just like talks about Wait. it. He's like, Yeah, yeah, man, I just fucking noticed that uh 
Like they weren't doing a lot of work And they like watched a bunch of movies <laughs> So I uh, started acting retarded <laughs> And I was in the special Whoa. class Like for all the high school Salute was, dude Dude salute to that him That rules It's the most dedication I've ever heard in my life dude A lot of It must uh, rule to be mentally retarded <laughs> Yeah you, know? you never just yeah. If you get you the good all day, You never do any work You yeah, get if you executed get the good when you're 32 A lot of them <laughs> yeah. are uh, You get to fuck one girl And then well, like, they execute you For killing yeah. her <laughs> Yeah <laughs> Rick Perry kills you. <laughs> <laughs> well, some of them get the bad kind where like they're scared all the time, you know. Oh, where yeah. it's like, ah, like you know, and I would, so I wouldn't true. like that one, but like, no, you want the happy one. The happy, like my the wife works yuhus. with special people, and and they there was uh, that's probably not what you call that's, them, yeah, special it's not people. <laughs> but because they, that that's that's what I mean. Like any term you use, and this is kind of it like doesn't a mentally work disabled. Anymore. This is like uh, a uh, mentally disabled. Uh, but it, it, any term you use. The problem is that you're using those words to describe somebody that's like not equal. I'm sorry. Like <laughs> you everybody's equal in terms of like you shouldn't be an asshole to them, but like they're not they're just sorry, it's like a deficiency. <laughs> right. And yeah. their life is never going to be a normal life. I mean yeah. it yeah. just won't. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure yeah. a lot of them can be like pretty functional, but like People are going to associate those words with somebody that has a fucking deficiency, and it's going to become an insult. No matter eventually, what. eventually, like no in, matter what, yes. every single it time. has a shelf life. Yeah, like all the words that we think are funny, like saying mongoloid literally was. Doctors used to say that shit. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, yeah. well, was, spe- even special well, needs. When I was a kid, funny. it's like, what is this guy special? I mean, it was Carlos yes. Mencia's whole act, right? Yeah. Ding, ding, ding. ding. God, man. <laughs> yeah. That's a good ass bit. Give that, That's a, a good ding, ass ding, ding, bit. Bro. Just literally yeah. making a retarded Stole it noise. From Joe Rogan, actually. <laughs> yeah. 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 What yeah. if that was the bit Rogan was <laughs> mad about? So I did the <laughs> gun, 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 gun yeah. bit. Yeah. But there's this dude at my wife's work that every every time he sees anyone, he just says, "Can I get a yay?" And then you got to say yay. And he goes, hell yeah. And oh, that's like his whole life. That man. guy rules. He just collects yay. That's just a, <laughs> that's just like, a black man. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's not retarded at all. He's in the staff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, uh, but your son is black. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get a yay? <laughs> hell yeah. <laughs> hamburger. Your son, is, like, your son is he's profoundly just a black. <laughs> Uh, oh. Profoundly black would be like a good woke <laughs> hip hop, you know. Name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's gonna be someone black. special. Yeah. yeah, that's gonna be someone special. Like an early '90s, like Afrocentric mm-hmm. hip hop. MC group. profoundly black. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, bitch. Hell yeah. Um, Damn. Well, they, don't got, they... they have song titles that are like "Why Come," you know. Mm. It's like, <laughs> Why come the government got <laughs> symbols on the money? Yeah. Why come I can't get a job? You know. <laughs> That was like a that was a good type of song. The just listing just the problems questions. as questions. Yeah. <laughs> the question songs? Yeah. Well dude. you're talking about that that uh who's that what's who does that song? Jada Kiss. That Jada Kiss. Jada Kiss. Song. Yeah, we yeah. talked about that already. <laughs> Question yeah. questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. What's that? 21 questions from 50 Cent. You guys remember that shit? Yeah. Yeah, right. but that was more of a fucking song. Yeah, but he was asking questions. Mm-hmm. True. It's a different genre. I Would admit. you love me if I was down and out? Mm-hmm. Would, Would you, you still love have love for Would me? You still have love. I remember that Fat music kid video. Love cake. I love remember you. that Fat music video because he fucks Megan. Would from you love me if Skeeter. you found out I was part of a pedophile ring? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Would you still? Have that music video if you is call about me spreading a boy's ass cheeks open. <laughs> Would you still <laughs> have love for <laughs> me, <laughs> nigger? <laughs> the video was about a conjugal visit. He was in jail. And then he goes to the trailer, and Megan Good comes to visit him, and then they fuck in the trailer. And then Ooh. I guess he goes back to jail. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. <laughs> it a very she held it down though. She did she's still coming hold it down. She's very hot. She's coming to get that jail dick. Yeah, I guess so. that pent up jail dick. <laughs> That's the. <laughs> That's probably a love. nice type of dick. Isn't there like? Aren't there? Don't people say he's gay? Fifty. Fifty. They say a lot of people are gay. Doctor Dre. Oh really? He's gay. Yeah, there's rumors that like. Tupac like wouldn't re- like record in a room with him. He's like, I don't want to be in here with this gay motherfucker. Like, get him oh. out. Like, all this stuff. It and is funny to him? think about how like all the people we think of like as like woke guys, 
It's like Tupac. Like Tupac now is like everyone's like he was a poet and shit. And like <laughs> he was homophobic as hell. Like, like, really offensive like, and homophobic. Yeah. yeah. He had some really dumbass ideas. I was watching a documentary about him. I don't remember any, but uh, I just remember being like, "Damn, Tupac was." Can you make dumb. one up? <laughs> yeah, he uh, he thought that uh, uh, everyone from Guatemala was actually uh, part uh, Aardvark. <laughs> nice, dude. <laughs> That's improv. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, was up, we were Hell at yeah. the pit last night. I was at the pit, yeah. And the, at next on the wall. Oh, I saw that picture. You said. <laughs> on the wall, they have. It's just like enormous on the fucking wall next to the stage, a clown's prayer. <laughs> oh, it's like, God. let me remember to make people laugh. That my my duty in this life it was may I may, to, may I create more to, laughter than is tears is to shine a light on the dark moments of others' lives. <laughs> uh, uh, like, well, how much of a fucking narcissist do you have to be to yeah. think that's what a comedian is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That is not like. Literally someone that did not want to do homework. Right. <laughs> yeah. I and don't want a real job. I don't yeah. want to, yeah. I decided I could have helped the world. Yeah. And yeah. I was like, no, that's gay. Yeah. I'm going to get fucked up and just talk about having I'm a little I'm going penis. to be an alcoholic that says retard out, yeah. so much that <laughs> eventually it's <laughs> funny again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Yeah. USA. Right. USA. It's also like that's not even like the definition of a of a comedian anymore for like the sanctimonious fucking pious comics. Because now yeah. your job is to speak truth to power. Ugh. Yeah, yeah. I you watched know? Brandon and I I'm watched. Stupid. Uh, I don't know shit. I just want to yeah. be funny. We I had a buddy like SNL. somebody was on stage recently, and my buddy was like, "Man, he's not even saying anything, dude." <laughs> And I'm like, what are you? Yeah, he was saying words, you know. He was talking about farts and stuff, you know. Yeah. Like, I know, but he's not like fucking saying anything. Shut up. I'm like, when uh, is that? When did that become the job? Like, I thought we, you know, we were supposed yeah. to make people laugh. Who was it? Name names. I don't want to. I don't want to do it. I love him. It he's a really Ian. funny guy. It was Ian not Fires. the guy on stage. The, cr- the I know. That's what I'm saying. I, I think he's a good. He's a. He is he funny? Name names. Oh, he's really funny. Yeah. All right. Really funny. Who was it? So it wasn't Adam. This was this was a year ago too. Maybe he's grown. Was it Taylor? No, <laughs> <laughs> definitely hasn't grown. Taylor, you piece of comedy. shit. Comedy, <laughs> um, catch him. Yeah, yeah. Um, no, it wasn't Taylor. Taylor uh, wouldn't say that. Stop, stop trying to get him to say who it was. Why? He's uncomfortable. I'll, I mean, look, this is a Hollywood gossip podcast. That's true. It's a blind it. item. True. Yeah, a certain comedian <laughs> spotted who may have a mustache and fucks <laughs> transsexuals. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Said this. Yeah, that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's good. Well, who was the comic on stage? Uh, I'm not gonna do that. I'll say who who said it. It was right. Mateo. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Mateo says says things. He says things. Yeah, no. Well, he, yeah. Mateo's a friend of the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Mateo. He does act. I also was that like, also just sounds like a dumb thing you'd say in the back of the room because you hate the person on stage. Yeah, you either you hate like the person yeah, on stage, yeah. or you just you, the impulse is to shit talk whoever's on stage because it's funny. It is right, so funny. Right. That's the best part yeah. of mm-hmm. comedy. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm acting like some hero who who wasn't in the back of the room. Like you know what? He's not saying shit. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm, acting, I'm acting like I was like above what he said. I was right. not above what he said. Um, but it's stupid. I think it's stupid for us both to think that way. You I know? do not think. Yeah. Even my friends, they're on stage. I'll sit in the back of the room and tear apart their entire act like <laughs> yeah while they're on stage to anyone who will listen yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah that's nice it doesn't matter what the who it is if mm-hmm. like a booker it, the, the thing is is comedy is always just garbage yeah you know? yeah and it's very part. easy to tear apart and it's day. also like when you're saying some up there to the crowd you're saying it for the first time but your buddies heard you say it 60 times yeah and so when you just like say a bre- line the breakfast out yeah, of any breakfast. of our set Thank like you. out of context yeah, if you say a really good joke out of context yeah. like like yeah. yeah really good yeah if i oh if you want to start going make... into each other's acts there adam <laughs> let's do it <laughs> <You're> fucking... <laughs> dude you, you get through it. 10 minutes of brandon's fucking show first the clues let's do it <laughs> you can say any line for mine I quit and I'll like stand up. I don't know why you're <laughs> yeah. going after me I admitted that I couldn't write anymore And I left doing it No you're still a good comic You just don't have confidence Oh no it's okay Speak on what? Oh, no, just go shit at, on Adam's act at, at No it's fine Go at him dude Go, no, hit me. go There are some things that, are, sa- that are sacred Now uh, that Adam and his father are both rapists No that is not But the act I won't do it Thank yeah. you That's part of the mm-hmm. clown's prayer uh, Yeah Is that yeah. you never <laughs> You never. If I had oh, to do man. it, I don't want that, to. But if I had to shit on Adam's act, I would say that. 
<laughs> he'll okay. tell a story. You and Flores do the same fucking goddamn thing where it's like oh, you, you have a new story bit, and the first time you do it, it's fine. And, and then, then and then as soon as you touch it again, well, you completely destroy it. Well, no, that's no it's bit. specifically no, it's not. No, that's not true. You guys and that's not true. Flores you, does this dumb you, shit. You just try no, 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 no. Flores when, will have like a perfect thirty second joke and it'll crush. And then the next time he does it, he's like, you know, oh, uh, the thing is, mm -hmm. is because, but actually, if you think about it, and it's like, just say the joke, right? You know. Right, well, yeah. yeah, that's true. But it's that I with mean, the story. That's a normal thing. Is that when you do a new joke that you're excited about, the first time you do it, you're like, this feels great. And then the second time you do it, it does. It's like, oh, uh, it doesn't work as yeah, well. Yeah, I mean, I feel like a and joke you has sort of a have shelf to re life where it's not fresh after a certain right. While. And then you have to sort of rebuild it after a while. With a joke, I can e more easily like jump into whatever the hell I meant the first time I said it than with a story. Because when I do a right. story, right. if it's like a five minute story and it just happened to me, yeah. I'm like still kind of going through it emotionally. So like I'm, I'm like talking, and that's to why the it's crowd. Like, and it is, it is crowd. funny yeah. though, because that, that that but the breakfast thing does work on like every comic. If you just repeat someone's punchline, it's to them, so mean. They oh, get defensive. It's, so it's uh, yeah, yeah, dude. If you it were really like, I wish we all were tickle yeah. fights, I'd be like, dude, fuck you, man. Come on, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come on. We're all trying up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, but I'm like it, it is completely easy to wreck every yeah. every comic. You're like it's not even my hand; it's like a little doll hand. Hey, whoa, whoa! whoa. <laughs> we don't have to keep doing my act. We don't have to keep that. I'm saying that's a great joke, yeah. but you say it out of context I had with a certain tone of voice. Made what's that? That's your custom. All right, this, uh, you know what, guys? I don't. We're not airing this one. I'm <laughs> exercising uh, at the thing Adam does. That usually. is a dumb part of the joke. I had a custom <laughs> remote made. No, I mean yeah, it's, it's obviously no, it's stupid. Funny man, it's, it's about having a little dick. I think there's a smaller version of a thing yeah. already you triple a batteries i could uh, put look, my thumb we're not, over the we're not workshopping a. my my act i right am now. we're doing it triple did you a know? no i don't think that's funny right? did not, you know that you can't spell cash you you can't spell take a shit without cash yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah it's a great job yeah, yeah it is a great job. joke <laughs> yeah we're all taking that, turns see, saying that, great hold jokes. on you're not you're not highly you're doing it wrong because you're not highlighting like just a punchline out of context that in and of itself is yeah, that's kind of a bummer. I guess joke. you're right. That one is like you a, can't spell "take a shit" without Kashi. It stands fuck, alone. That does, yeah. Which, if you examine my material, every aspect <laughs> every of my sentence. comedy <laughs> is infinitely. Any <laughs> line out of context, I do what I like joke. to call fractal comedy, <laughs> <laughs> where no matter how far you zoom in, it's yeah. still perfect. <laughs> oh man, I'm trying to remember the rest of the bit now, so I can get it. No, fuck. one that isn't perfect. I completely oh, forgot next? that joke. I think it's all perfect. Dude. I think you're right. No, it's yeah. not. Um, it is. No, it's gay and bad. <laughs> <laughs> what just happened there? I don't know. The PS4 <laughs> fell asleep, and I think <laughs> this thing is yeah diaping out. Do you miss Do you miss stand up? I'm gonna go do spots tonight. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah you should. You should. I'm trying to like force do more yeah, spots. Yeah. yeah. Are you it. going back because you miss it or? Yeah. Well, yeah. I need to socialize and like it does keep you sharp. And I'm mm -hmm. like, it's not when I stop doing stand up. It's like I have all these other things I'm working on, and I'm yeah. like not working on anything now. I'm gonna stop like deluding myself into thinking I'm gonna finish a. And we have funny script moms on or Monday. whatever. Yeah. And it's just like shit. you know, I like I miss going out. Yeah, man. I miss seeing you out there, dude. You're a funny guy. Thanks, you man. Know? No. no, that's good. I think that's very He's good gay news, Nick. And bad. <laughs> um, yeah. fuck, I'm hungry, dude. You're always hungry. That's not true. Yeah, it is. Yes, it Sometimes is. I'm so not happy eat. when we just got dinner the other day. I was <laughs> happy. The only time I'm dude, happy food is makes when me I'm eating food. So fucking that, happy. I had fun last night. Going, me and that Stav went to the cellar and ate wings. You know, it's funny. Like uh, those are the best wings. Did you dude. read Guy Branham's like fucking article yeah, yeah, about yeah, how yeah, yeah. Uh, the cellar, a place where gay people are banned. Well, that's uh, yeah, 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 women yeah, yeah, are yeah, not yeah. allowed in the cellar, yeah, and if yeah. they enter, they will be raped. What the fuck is this? He's like, it's a metaphor. Yeah, it's like you described a literal table. Right. Right, right, and its right. exact location. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then yeah. named yeah. the people at the table. <laughs> yeah, and then made a declarative statement about who's allowed that to you sit. Don't there. know yeah. dick about. Yeah, and so the seller did tell me that gay people weren't allowed. Yeah, yeah. Um, you you're not allowed. Well, we so I'm we go gay. there because you're gay. <laughs> people we're make all there. kinds of excuses We're when sitting they don't there. want a person. And yeah, a table yeah. over, there's some guy berating a woman about men's rights. It was pretty hilarious. I've never seen that in public so in my life. I guess guys right. <laughs> yeah. I literally have never <laughs> it seen that. It was some I can tell this guy that's like, "We are 90% more likely to go to jail. We are 90% more likely to be a victim of violent crime." <laughs> <laughs> just like standing there. <laughs> it was like, "What is happening?" Yeah. Wow. That guy came over and introduced himself in the tried to like burn us 
Yeah, he, he uh, was what guy Brandon was talking about, like yeah. some dumbass. Who, but he but wasn't this a wasn't comic, a comedian, was right? I think he guy. probably was some shitty comic who thinks that's how you make it. You go to the cellar and then you like start until... shitting on people just until uh, people are like, whoa, I respect how yeah, that guy yeah. shits on. Uh, he heard strangers. some Patrice O'Neill stories. Not a white stories. man, by the yeah. way. Yeah, yeah. Who? point that out. Whoever the, I don't, I couldn't deduce what race he was. Yeah, he looked like one of those like uh, Polynesians. Those people. Yeah, no. You know, where they're like a sausage black, but they don't have a black face. <laughs> oh, yeah, like Polynesian kind no, of. No, like a real dark ass Indian dude. Yes. Oh, yeah. that was kind of, he kept saying the N word. <laughs> yeah. So he did. It was weird. I thought I thought it was dude, everybody's saying the N word, like Puerto Ricans and Puerto and, Ricans get a yeah, that's they, a New York they, thing. It's a New York city. Is that, yeah. it? Is that it? Yeah, yeah like yeah. we're in New York right now. We say it. All people yeah. of color. <laughs> <Right. laughs> <Yeah. They're, laughs> right. that, that Chinese family I lived with, the son, who was like 14. <laughs> or whatever <laughs> and like he's a nice kid but like he was I mean he just sat and played like MMORPGs all day long he would sit at his laptop and I would hear him on like you know voice chat with like other Chinese kids or whatever and he was always dropping in bombs <laughs> <laughs> but he didn't like do any part of the voice he had like a thick Chinese accent and then he would just also say the n-word whoa nice yeah wow, it was man. bizarre Are you, but isn't that how you say didn't you have that bit where it's like that's also how you say Come it is. They use something? it as a filler material. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Chinese, like in Mandarin Chinese. Every black comic that goes to China comes back with that bit. By the way, Have, like yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. that's yeah. 100%. How it's like they, they're like, <laughs> what is it? It's like yeah, they use it as. I a, was at Starbucks in Shanghai. Yeah. And all of a sudden, the Starbucks guy keeps saying, and then he just. Shouts. I like your black guy voice is just fucking <laughs> Jeff Foxworth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, a black man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If well, you go to China to and get offended, yeah. you <laughs> might be a black man. <laughs> yeah. 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 What was I supposed to? What kind of accent was I supposed to use? You know the kind. <laughs> you know it, man. You know how to you do know. it. You know. So I was in China. <laughs> <laughs> That's your black guy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're still not committing to audio black. You know, it's funny because it's like it's racist to do black guy voice, but it's way more racist to not be able to do black. Guy <laughs> yes. Voice. That last one was Chinese. He's like, I was in yeah, China. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, yeah, like a black. I, I am a black China. man. I am a African American man. <laughs> That's Japanese. Yeah, yeah, that's not Chinese. <laughs> no, China. Yeah, yeah. Chinese black guy. I know. I was just Real doing black. other accents. Oh, okay. Um, but you can be um, black bleak. with an Australian accent. I'm a bleak mean. I'm bleak. I'm a bleak mean. I'm a bleak mean. The thing about South Africa is you have to make your mouth as small as possible. Don't yeah. tell me about it. Because they, they love sucking Don't dick down. Tell me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And you might accidentally signal <laughs> another man if you yeah. open your mouth too wide. That's so, so true. Like, I'm just trying to yeah. be booked today. They buddy <laughs> rape. I hope no one rapes in my mouth. Dude, dude he's trying to make, make it to the store. I hope no one rapes in my mouth. <laughs> Don't fuck me, mouth, please. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, please stop fucking my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and that's where Adam comes from. Yeah, it's a proud Los culture. Angeles. Um, guys, what was I gonna say? Oh, Brandon and I watched SNL last night, and they did a, I don't know, in my estimation, kind of a problematic episode because they had a black female host, and so then they tried to like Tiffany Haddish. Yeah, they tried to like r respond to like. All of the controversy by doing like by s celebrating that, and it was it just what do you mean completely what? failed? What by they did like a video game sketch? <laughs> I hadn't watched a full episode of SNL in forever. Uh -huh. They did a video game sketch, was like Mortal Kombat. You're like it was the player select screen, and it was like Scorpion, like uh, you know mm -hmm. uh, Sub Zero, Sub Zero, and then it was like. Boo Boo Jenkins. Oh, it fuck. was just it was just a minstrel. <laughs> what? The entire episode, Boo Boo Jenkins. The entire episode was a minstrelsy, and it was like so. so powers that she says Beyonce and Rihanna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Her power. Yeah, her, one of her powers was saying the word Beyonce. Ugh. And oh, yeah, it was man. just like rough. Ugh. Yeah. So new comedy is about to be really good now. That <laughs> Oh man! What was um, like? I mean, that sounds pretty funny to me. I completely <laughs> missed the setup. Uh, I heard minstrel when I, 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 I yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, they did another one where she was like, they were they were just kids in a there were kids in a forest, and then they're like walking around, and then she like walks up to them. She's like, "I'm the last black unicorn," and it makes no sense what any of it's about. It makes absolutely no sense. And then they and then uh, what's her name? Leslie Jones comes out and she's like, I'm also a black uni unicorn. 
And it's just there isn't a laugh. It's just like nice. really uncomfortable. And then I found out this morning, Brandon found out this morning that she's about to publish a book called The Last Black Unicorn. What? Uh, so it was Tiffany fucking Haddish. Was, so it was fucking like, so it was like product promo, placement. Yeah. Subliminally like trying to get you to buy a book in the future. In oh the future, but it, it made absolutely no sense. It was like it was really, it was really. So confusing. I hear I, I can kind of read between the lines of what you're saying, Adam. No more black women should be hosting. No, SNL. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. What okay. I think is you, you know the story about. Okay, Steven I mean Seagal. I don't I don't agree, but if Steven, that's how you feel. Steven Seagal on SNL, where you know like he he had his own his own sketches that he wanted to pitch. It's so you can't. And one of them is he's a therapist that you know like there's a rape victim and steven seagal like is the therapist who starts molesting her while jesus the christ and the whole staff had to like explain to him why it wasn't funny <laughs> <laughs> you know? like that's his idea of yeah, comedy yeah. well hilarious. he just got exposed the last two weeks no everyone's known that about of course, steven seagal of course, of course but his name is like you can't expose <laughs> steven seagal yeah he's a detestable everyone knew about shit. cosby everyone knew about like you know no but that's why it's that's like the charlie funny. sheen thing it's like charlie sheen raped a 13 year old boy and nobody gives a shit because it's Charlie Sheen. Right. <laughs> it's like, pretty funny. It, that makes sense that Charlie Sheen would have done that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What is, what is, why is Brandon having a seizure? Because it's a pretty funny sketch, the, what, what Steven Seagal Oh, was it the is one? funny, dude. Yeah. <laughs> That's the thing. It's like th they had the wrong take, which is, Steven, it's very funny, especially considering who you are. Right, 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 right. <laughs> like, this right. won't be good for your career, nor right. will it be good for SNL. Didn't that, isn't it like really hard to get the Seagal, like the monologue and the sketches from that episode? Like they tried to like erase it from the internet. But I think there's some daily motion clips. Mm. Of the Steven Seagal SNL, but they're all like amazing. They're all really. It's funny. the best of Steven Seagal <laughs> on Saturday Night Live. Come here, Sherry. Let me rape you. Yeah. <laughs> please stop. Please, please stop. I have a family. <laughs> Live from New York. <laughs> it's Saturday night. What if it's the Spartans, but I rape the Spartans? Yeah, it it's 300 but it's the number of women I've assaulted <laughs> <laughs> when did he host it what era was that probably out yeah. for justice era yeah yeah early 90 mid 90 probably ruthless aggression era yeah yeah yeah. yeah yeah they just had him on <laughs> the episode before Trump yeah yeah, yeah Trump <laughs> the Trump Seagal double special yeah, yeah. fucking app <laughs> God damn. He does the monologue in a chair. Yeah. <laughs> With those yellow sunglasses. <laughs> do you remember SNL made Trump do hotline bling? That was so miserable. Oh, what? Yeah, when he hosted, he did a hotline bling parody. Thank anyway, God. the point of what I was trying to say was like they were trying no, to No, we have, already said you don't want No, they, they were trying to have like an inclusive <clears throat> they were trying to have like an inclusive like at like episode, but they just ended up using the black people on the show in the most racist As props. Way ever. Yeah, it was like really Difficult to watch, but I watched. I ended up watching the whole thing. Well, what a hero, dude! Yeah. <laughs> you, yeah. You're fucking like, hero, man. I mean, sometimes it's just so bad it's good. I guess you know. Yeah. You gotta I see. Like I don't know. I don't. I haven't break. watched it. Like I feel like I hadn't watched it all season until yeah. last night. I don't think I've sat down and watched SNL since 2002. Yeah, like Will Ferrell. Yeah, it was the last time I really fucking watched. Yeah, I was right. really into yeah. it when the Bush versus Gore. Yeah, yeah, strategery. Happening. Remember, when I was that like shit? in sixth yeah. grade. Lockbox. Remember right? that? Yeah, that was that, hilarious. That, when, they did that one with like that senator that, where, where he's like, uh, blind people think they're so cool. I <laughs> can't stand the Chinese. Was that Fred, Fred Thompson? <laughs> I, yeah, I can't remember who it was supposed to be, but well, those two, those two, that's funny. lines out of context yeah, are hilarious. Yeah. They're very funny. <laughs> yeah. That's back when people would take risks. Yes. Um, yeah, it's just us now, the real truth tellers. And yeah, and then Kinda, they, they like you know? made, they made fun Not of Louie. Not to toot my own horn, but I got a different clown sprayer, and it's all the N word. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of clown just says the N word? <laughs> um, Penny Pennywise. Pennywise. <laughs> the, the, the S and Wise is a dollar sign. <laughs> you remember it? <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's Damon. Damon. That is like uh, a pimp's clown. name. Yeah, yeah. I don't understand why that was Pennywise. Pennywise? Yeah, yeah, right. It's a great pimp. Pennywise yeah. is a great pimp name. <laughs> yeah. Hey, bitch. Let me yeah. let me spit it to you straight. <laughs> I ain't I'm just a, wise. I'm gonna turn your wise, asshole bitch. into a penny loafer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm put a little pe All my bitches got pennies in their ass. <laughs> and the wise part is because of knowledge. 
<laughs> Where does the wise part come from? <laughs> yeah. It's because I know that female genital mutilation is good. <laughs> <laughs> His balloons are just harem balloons in their assholes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, we're done balloon. actually. Hold on, All let right. me uh, uh, let me plug some dates, guys. Uh, I'm doing hey. fucking. I'm coming to Baltimore the Wednesday before Thanksgiving, the 22nd. Yeah, Don't I mean, fucking unplug it, you fucking <laughs> cocksuckers. Unplug it. I mean, this show isn't you know your personal. <laughs> If you guys were to do, if you guys were to do fucking shows, you should plug them too. I'm not serious. The 16th, I'm in fucking Boston. Well, you said the thing about yeah. breakfast, and it's still, I'm still hurt by it. Yeah. Uh, the 16th, oh, you can't use the show to plug your show. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, so yeah, 22nd, I'm in thanks, thanks before Thanksgiving, I'm in He's fucking at the buffet, Baltimore, sidebar. 20, 23rd, the, he's at the hospital for. <laughs> Blowing out his appendix with crab legs. <laughs> <laughs> December third, I'm in Cleveland at Hilarities, and uh, on the sixteenth, I'm in Boston at the House of Blues. So come get sucked off, and, everyone. And then uh, December eighteenth, uh, custard. That's all it says on his calendar. <laughs> Just the word. That's custard. the whole week of the eighteenth. <laughs> yeah. I will be doing backstrokes, <laughs> okay. uh, he uh, forgot Scrooge what McDuck that. style, <laughs> right. in a pool of custard. Intravenous custard. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta taste that. The, shit, man, the man versus food comedy tour. I would love that. Wasn't that guy stand up actually? No, no, he wasn't. Okay, um, and then again, guys, because this we said it on the premium, but we didn't say it on the main one. On the twenty second of December, oh yes, at Black Cat, we're making this is an announcement official. It's big, happening. big announcement. We're doing a live come town holiday spectacular extravaganza. Our triumphant return to Washington D.C. Uh, from whence we came. All three boys will be at the fucking Black Cat. The Black Cat, the twenty Friday, the twenty second of December. Mm. Uh, please come. I love that venue. And don't no. let the name fool you. It will be a racially segregated. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck! And uh, oh no, Funny Moms was is yesterday. Yeah, Funny Moms was two days ago now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we'll be back after Thanksgiving for Funny and, Moms. And uh, yeah. Evan, uh, you can find my dates at evanwilliamscomedy dot com. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram. At it's Evan Williams. Ooh, and he's oh, buff. Cool. He's Come cute. Check out your he's boy. cute as shit. Brandon, you got anything you want to plug? Uh, yeah, but still. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. My Brandon's a pod- podcast. Brandon's got a now. podcast. Can we shit on wow. this for a minute, guys? Oh yeah. Actually, well, no. we should. We should give it a <laughs> no, <negative. no. laughs> Let's just listen to it. I haven't listened. I'm gonna no. it up. What's the podcast, man? What are you doing? <laughs> it's good. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> it's Hell like a sort cell, of a dude. socialist bad boy podcast, you know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> there, that, there was no real space for that. You know, nobody's yeah. doing that podcast. He does it with this guy, Jack Wagner, who's the <laughs> grandson of Versace Tamaguchi. He's the grandson of uh, the Wagner, the Oh, the German guy, the composer. German composer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, I, will, I will say that uh, somebody from the Cumtown subreddit already made a subreddit for my <laughs> podcast. Mm-hmm. And it's it's just, there's just one post and it just says, Brandon Wardell is racist. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's not wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Well, uh, he um, did just plug it on the show, so I hope. Uh, damn, no! Uh, everyone, listen to it and don't and don't be rude. Yeah, go listen to it, subscribe, <laughs> give it a five star rating. If he launches a Patreon, don't subscribe to that. Brandon makes enough money. Double off. down on us. If he yeah. launches a Patreon, exactly. give us ten dollars. We're going a month. to give us Step ten. Yeah. yeah, maybe in a couple years when MTV gets tired of trying to turn Brandon into a household name. <laughs> <laughs> Then you can donate to his Patreon. But as long as he's riding that, you know, (laughs) sneaker uh, rap. No, he's out. He's done. I mean, they're not, you know, I'm not not working with MTV at at this current juncture. Or Vice or, you know, I don't know, Logo or whoever the fuck. We are going to go. Logo, Logo, yeah. Logo, yeah. Bringing back the big gay sketch show. Logo, that's supposed to be like a deaf person (laughs) saying homo, right? Oh, oh, that's true. It's very inclusive. Oh, logo sexual. Oh, homo. Yogo yegual. Like Lou Ferrigno and Puffing Iron. Oh, no. Yeah. You do, do a fun voice to, to take us out, Evan. I'm just doing it. Another one. Did a fun right one. His dad was the best. Lou, yeah. Lou yeah. you're the best. Dad. You're like, you're like, you you're like something Michelangelo. Michelangelo. Yeah. Michelangelo. <laughs> Look at you, Louis. Louis. Uh, yeah, man. Well, a classic app, everyone. I Thanks, mean, Evan Williams, our really, good bud. What yeah, an app. Check him dude. out. All right. Good night, bitch. 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 Good night, bitch.